With Kunoichi's help, Mitsunari narrowly avoided defeat. Ieyasu took the opportunity to displace him, thereby greatly expanding his power base. Mitsunari turned to Kanetsugu Naoe for help in overthrowing Ieyasu. Yukimura joined them in battle at Sekigahara, but to no avail. Mitsunari was captured and put to death. Kanetsugu pledged allegiance to Ieyasu, and Yukimura was forced into exile. Ieyasu's rule was now disputed only by the Toyotomi clan, who soon faced the brunt of his wrath. Yukimura, not satisfied to let Ieyasu have the last word, once again took up his spear. Yukimura marched forward despite the overwhelming odds. Kunoichi knew that the road ahead would not be easy.